Good morning everyone, my name is Mr. Vicente Milon Kisayu Jr., your BS Ed English 1 or 2, uh, North Sushaton Campus. So today we are going to be analyzing the text entitled, We All Became a Story by F.C. Marie Esperas. By the way, I'm so sorry with my husky voice and um, I am used, by the way, I'm also using my script because I'm not really good at memorizing some text or essay. So, uh, Lula Mimai is 80 years old. Everybody nearby is, a fami is familiar to her. The grandkids of her neighbors are not is not an exception. Lola is also familiar with her lives, experiences, and ups and downs. As the title suggests, the novella primarily discusses other people's lives. There is a twist, though. The supporting character is Lula Mimai, she actually assisted the main character in the discovering the truth during the entire story she had been presenting. The per first point of view is the first person perspective or the first person point of view is used in the text. The major character of the story is the narrator and we could see that her thoughts and emotions were immediately communicated to us. The narrator's perspective is used to watch other characters such as Lola Mimai. The characters, or there are just two characters in this text, the narrator and Lula Mimai, an 80, an 80 years old woman who serves as a supporting character. Although it is not explicitly stated that Lula Mimai has a family of her own, the narrator refers to her as Lula due to her age, where the implied uh, narrator is clear to see. Through their dialogue with Lula Mimai, as the story develops, the narrator invites us to consider critically what her character, thoughts, and life were. This is backed up by the later portion of the narrative, when she became aware of her wounds she had. Uh, the incident took place on the dark afternoon. They, they were relaxing on the patio near the water as a storm grew closer. The fishermen trying their boats or tying their boats uh, serves as justification for this, which stated openly in the narrative. This literary, sorry, this literary work serves as framing, a tale within a story present. It was clear that the main character, the, the main character was telling the reader, the reader's story about how the the sinister secrets were coming to light. The narrative starts when the narrator describes Lola Mima's life before the light or before to the storm then another story about someone else life entered and so on until the truth was revealed the plot or the plot of the story in this brief narrative flashback are used the story of lula mimai are snapshots of lives of those around her character versus self is the theme of the story when the narrator of the narrative uh, learned about her background she went uh, though a painful experience of tremendous inner conflict because the scenes are based on actual events uh, in, in, in the narrative is uh, realistic. An overview of Lula Mimai's life from six years ago and now opens to the text. The play then moves on the second act when Lula Mimai begins to educate everyone around her about how Renan became to, gay, become to be gay. How a life-saving albulario recovered Renan after he had been uh, electrocuted and other topics. Uh, the, the rising action, Lula Ipang's narrative, is where the rising action begins. This is a secondary narrative that plays a significant role in the narrator's life. Teenage Lula Ipang was carrying undressed illegitimate daughter Mia because child was a result of a broken promise. Lula Ipang daughter uh, Lula Ipang detested her. Josie, her adopted daughter, also gave birth to a kind or to a kid without a father. Uh, she was looked after by Lola Ipang. When Lola Mimai begins to remember another tale about a couple who live across the street, the story really picks up. Lola Mimai expressed regret as she detailed the couple's way of life. The man was a jerk. The, and the woman had been beaten. She used the cash for personal enjoyment, then came a night just before the storm. When the pair had their worst argument ever, which resulted into the woman being injured. 
and they ultimately uh, parted ways. Lula Mimay was present, so it happened and gave the woman consolation. The narrator was shocked when Lola Mimay introduced the word Shirley following her account about a woman who lived across the street. It was always her. All of her memories surf, surf, resurfaced. It, it, it hits her with agony. One of its, of its time, uh, timeless masterpiece. Her statement, I could not think straight or even feel straight. Maybe because I could not remember anything after he went, provided evidence for this. Not every story has a satisfying conclusion. This narrative story leaves the reader hanging. The text comes to a starting or a startling conclusion. Readers were kept in suspense and unsure of what would happen in the novel beyond this point due to an abrupt change in the plot. The story explicit theme is that we all end up being a stories. We all become stories was lined by the Lola Mimai, by Lola Mimai, that alludes to the fact that anytime someone passes away or lives, they are typically remembered by a narrative about something they, they did during their life. Rena left with the notion and Andres was gay, that Josie was pregnant in her adolescent years, and that Andres was living in Ipangs with a child. The Shirley, or that Shirley was narrator and that, the, that she eventually lost her memory after a heated argument with Louis. The impressions we leave on others may be cause, or the impression we leave on others may cause them to feel that life will lead, discourage, or inspire them. Regardless of whether we lose our memories as a result, of a traumatic experience or by choice. But may everyone who follows in our footsteps find us inspiring in how we overcome our challenges. The text We All Become Stories by F.C. Esperas, which makes use a variety of verbal elements, has concluded our text analysis. I appreciate you listening. Thank you.